Hey guys, I want to do the, the testing roundup for the uh, Golden Mask uh, Finder 5. And this is it. No more testing. It's just, it has earned its way into the just normal rotation now. It's just earned its, its way in there big time. And it's especially good for old parks because with it, for some reason, I just dig more nickel signals. And in an examination of this is this is about the length of one of my normal lunch hunts. All three of these together. It's been an hour, 15 minutes, hour and a half. Maybe, you know, 15 minutes more or less than a normal lunch hunt. A little bit more. And uh, in that little, in this time I have a, this is a Mexican, I don't know if that's 20 centavos uh, coin. It took me a while to, a uh, 50 I mean. It's a 50. I have no idea exactly what that is, but it's a Mexican coin. It read as a nickel. I have another nickel here. And I have another nickel. And another little bit here that rang as a nickel. So for some reason I'm finding nickel signals easier to dig with this. And I and I'm hitting old parks and digging these nickel signals and finding nickels and something pretty nice here. You know, not great, but you know. It's something we look forward to. Maybe not in that size, but we do look forward to it. And the rest of these were just general, uh, you know, coins. Uh, very shallow uh, quarters I found there. Shotgun head stamp. This is just some trash I dug because I was digging nickel signal signals. By the way, I also got this as a nickel signal. It, it looks like a Chinese coin. Now, it's not actual Chinese coin. It probably is a charm, and it probably was the connector for the charm bracelet. So we'll put that there too. So that's three signals that I may or may not have gotten with the others. For some reason, it's easier to ignore nickel signals when it is a different uh, uh, timber or a different tone from the rest. But since this is a relic machine and the tones are, are the same throughout the high conductive range, you look and you dig and you consider every signal when you go across it and that helps a lot in any case uh just wanted to show you that real quick and the highlight is right here and it's probably going to be the title of this video no doubt and let's see if i can get this real close all right guys here we go i think that's a dog's butt <laughs> it looks like it could have been an earring with a dog's butt but the most impressive thing is on the back here that says let me get this over here that says 925 so a little dirty here but that's a sterling charm so uh the uh golden mask ends the uh, test cycle with a little piece of silver. Alright, I just wanted to show you that and uh, you know you'll be seeing the uh, the Safari, you'll be seeing the XP Deus, and you'll be seeing the Golden Mask and the Spectra V3I in the future. Just want to let you know that uh, uh, I gotta give the Golden Mask a very strong A, maybe even an A plus, and it will be utilized uh, in the uh, in the uh, the lineup, uh, you guys have a wonderful day.